one of the crazy things we do in this class is this idea of badges. And we can call it what you want. I'm just using it mostly because it's a trendy name. Um, badges can be a variety of things. It's basically a certificate that we replace with maybe like a sticker or just a title. Um, maybe micro certifications. Um, it's kind of a hot thing in education right now. Uh, but we're really using these for you to demonstrate ways that you go above and beyond. If you would like to earn an A in this course, uh, we expect you to do more than just the minimum requirements. So what we have is uh, the grading uh, criteria for the course is a rubric, and we grade holistically, which means you have to meet all the criteria for an A if you'd like to earn an A. And you need to earn to do all the criteria for a B or better if you'd like to earn a B. And so out of all the criteria, if you earn all of it except in one area, then you didn't make it. That is the standard. That is what an A student looks like. Um, so one of them is that we ask you to earn five badges. So what is a badge? It's just things that you can do to show uh, that you really help out people in your class, that ways that you go above and beyond, um, ways that you show yourself extending yourself as a professional educator, that you, you know, attend a conference, that you attend a coffee queue, um, you create some materials for classmates and put some of the stuff we're doing into practice. So I have listed on the quest list, um, if you look on there, there's methods objectives, there's tech objectives, and there are badges. At the bottom, you'll also notice some tabs, and one of the tabs does say badges, so you can actually filter that out and look at just the things that you can do for badges. But I'm always looking for new ideas. So if you think there is something that you're doing that is worthy of a badge. Um, we don't think all A students look the same. There's a lot of ways that you can demonstrate to us that you're really extending yourself um, to be a better educator and being a part of a community of learners. Um, so if there's something you're doing that's not on there, let us know. We'd love to add it. it uh, there's badge 300 is to create your own. Um, but, of course, it's by approval, so uh, you know, ask us about it. We'd love to discuss, does that really reach the level of going above and beyond, or is this just something kind of we already do? So uh, they're not hard to get, so don't stress about it. Um, but it is something you're going to need to intentionally take a look for and plan which things are you going to make sure that you are doing.